Hi everyone, welcome back. Well, I was going through the archives again, looking at pictures, and uh, you know, I pulled up a, a couple that were pretty darn interesting. And I told uh, I told my wife, I said, "Look at these rocks." I said, "I guarantee you, these rocks are not rocks; they're buildings." And uh, yeah, sure enough, after I processed the picture a little bit, there they were. Uh, absolutely. I'm uh, showing you some pictures. I'm probably going to do this fairly often. Uh, this is what you see uh, everywhere you look. Um, buildings with openings, the cityscapes, the little box buildings. Um, they're everywhere. So a beautiful picture. This is one of those ones that's pretty clear. I mean, uh, for the first time that I can think of in a while, I can actually um, zoom in on it, you know, 1400% or more, and it doesn't explode into pixels. I don't know if this one got by them or what. And the beauty of this particular um, picture is is that it has uh, a cityscape uh, on the horizon. You know, and that that's really telling. You know, you may not be able to see the shapes of buildings, but when you see the shapes of buildings on the horizon, that's they're unmistakable. And uh, you know, in this case, I would say undeniable. Um, and just like before, you have all the ones you can see and then all the mishmash below it. It's a hard to see. Um, in my last video, I tried to pull that out as much as I could. Um, I think it was pretty good. I think you could see uh, as long as you um, were going to take the time, you, you'd definitely be able to see what I'm talking about here. But these, uh, I love these uh, inverted negative shots because uh, the uh, silhouette is so great on the horizon. But I mean, this picture works too, you know. Um, either way, uh, you see all along the, the bluffs up there or on the top of that mountain or whatever you want to call it are structures. And uh, that's so typical. Uh, everywhere. Uh, they well, I mean, they build everywhere. So I guess they're going to build on the bluffs, the plateaus, the valleys, the hills. Uh, they're you know literally everywhere. So I, I guess it's no surprise. But these uh, cityscapes on the horizon are a little bit hard to come by. At least like this. I mean, probably very hard to come by. I did see one on a video uh, recently where somebody uh, sent in a. A picture that they managed to pull out a cityscape on one of these panoramics and it was an amazing cityscape but I can't do it I don't know what they did I've been trying and trying I've, I can see it back there but I can't pull it up so here's another one that I pulled out uh, this one came out of the multimedia and these are pictures of rocks this is what you see everywhere they're not rocks if you look in all of the pictures you see this shape over and over and over um, you know, you think they're rocks, but after a while, you know, why are all the rocks triangular or shaped like that other one, you know? And here's a classic picture I was telling you about. I was talking to my wife about. I guarantee you these are buildings, what I told her. And uh, that's that's a clear shot right there. I haven't touched that. That is unaltered. And then, uh, uh, you know, once you um, sharpen it up a little bit, uh, the, uh, the shapes will come out. But it's always the same. Uh, these will be, uh, you know, the, what do you call it, uh, like stair steps going up the sides, uh, kind of temple-like. And then, interestingly, uh, in front of all these, these big rocks are buildings. These are other big buildings. And NASA really screws you up on the scale. You think you're looking at rocks that are maybe 50 feet, 100 feet away. They're very far away, and they're not just rock. Well, not rocks as usual, like I said, but you can't tell by the scale uh, it's really really difficult and uh, they've actually tried uh, messing us up you know when they give us a little meter on what the scale is it's you know complete lie so I'm still working on trying to figure out a way to scale the size on on everything we look at but that's the trick for them it's all about um, fooling you thinking you're looking at something close and you're looking at something really very far away and there's much more in the uh, foreground uh, than, than they would have you believe. Anyway, thanks for watching. It's just a quick one. I had to get these up. I was really excited about it. We'll be revisiting this area in more detail. See you soon.